federal judge addressed the elephant in the room by bringing up U.S. immigration policy as a group of people became United States citizens during a ceremony in the Pine Belt. 29 people took the Pledge of Allegiance in front of friends and family. WJTV's Micah Barnes-Garcia spoke with just some of the new Americans. And today I bring this one go home. I think all oh, four children. <laughs> They're very really happy, you know. They wait me too long, you know. Sundip T. Mai came to the United States 23 years ago with her parents who worked for the U.S. military. She has since started her own family here in the United States and is the last of her family that includes four children and her husband to become a U.S. citizen. Just try one time, two time, three time, you know, because every, t every day I'm working hard and I don't have time to try, you know, that this time I real, 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 I want to come to the city and I try hard, hard and more, you know, and right now, I passed already, and I'm so happy, you know, come to the city. We spoke to a woman from South Korea who had not been able to apply for a job with just her green card, but being naturalized will fix that. My friends did all the, um, they did the, law, they hire lawyers and stuff, uh, lawyers and other people, but. Um, I did myself. I looked at online and trying to figure out what to, the steps going on. So it was pretty easy. U.S. Judge Magistrate Michael Parker addressed immigration policy and he said from a court's perspective, they enforce the law. The one thing on immigration that everyone agrees on is this process. Everyone here today has, has done everything the law requires to become a citizen, has shown dedication to the country, and we celebrate that. Whoever comes in the future I don't I don't want to tell them like don't just don't afraid I finally feel like home like I found my place <laughs> Micah Barnes Garcia WJTV Channel 12 well, this is only the second time the naturalization ceremony has been held outside of the courtroom. The ceremonies are typically held four to five times out of the year. 